What is up, everyone? Welcome back to the Four Strength Channel. I hope everybody's having a great day. I hope you're getting after it, all right? We're back here in my garage gym where I share with you how to build muscle strength, endurance, build your overall health and fitness, build that athletic, uh, that athleticism from home using kettlebells, clubs, maces, unconventional training. You're gonna get benefits of strength training, endurance training. You're gonna get your cardio, okay? It's full body, it's functional, okay? You're gonna be a stronger person out there in the real world. I welcome you, and for anybody who's new, please go ahead and press that subscribe button. We hit 2,000 subscribers, all right? This is just the beginning of the Four Strength family, okay? So I welcome you, join the pack, and you'll know that if you apply that discipline, that consistency, and that uh, consistent grind, you're gonna see results, okay? You're gonna come out of here stronger. Today, double kettlebell complex, full body. You already know this is my style of training, okay? That means if you're training four to five times uh, a week, okay, you're gonna see results as, as long as you stay consistent, okay? When you train full body, you're training, comp you're doing compound exercises uh, and you're gonna be burning more calories, you're gonna be using more muscles, you're gonna see more results, the intensity is a lot higher, so you might need a couple of more days to rest. Let's get after today's training session. I'm gonna be using my double 24 kilos, grab a weight that's gonna challenge you. And we're gonna start with a little warm up. Uh, you already know me. I'm all about dynamic warm ups, all right? Get jumping jacks in there, get burpees, push ups, whatever you wanna do for the day to get that blood flowing to the muscles, you know, all over your body so you can prep in from the main workout. I'm gonna start off with 100 jumping jacks and we'll go from there. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 3, 34, 35, 6, 7, 8, 39, 40, 1, 2, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, fifty, 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 Eight, nine, eighty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ninety, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one hundred. into the main workout. Four push presses, four squats, four cleans, 10 alternating rows. We're gonna do that for four to five rounds. Uh, we're gonna keep the rest time one minute to one minute and 30 seconds rest. At any time, if you need any more uh, rest, go ahead and do that. And uh, just be mindful of the rest you take. You don't wanna take too long of a rest where uh, you can cool off, the intensity is not high, you don't get a good workout out of it. So let's begin. First one, four push presses. Four front squats. Please. In ten alternating rows. One, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I'm gonna go ahead and do twelve. I know everybody doesn't have enough weights to play around with. If you need to make your uh, the session harder, you can always do more rounds or increase the reps or decrease the rest time. Be mindful of how you breathe, in through your nose, out through your mouth. You have a better recovery time when you inhale through your nose. Better form of regulating your heart rate, okay? Bringing the intensity just enough so where you get that recovery time and hit the next round. More controlled more control of your breathing, the, uh, the better workout you're gonna have. Second round. Alternating rows, six on each side. What I love about kettlebells is that you're gonna engage every single muscle in your body. Even with those back rows, okay? It's mainly focused on your back muscles, correct? But since you're squatting and holding that position, your legs are gonna be on fire, okay? Especially depending on what weight you're holding, okay? You're isolating that stance, and every time you get that jerking motion right here, okay, you're gonna feel it on your legs. This is why the way I train is so effective. So if you wanna build a stronger physical body, okay? Push yourself mentally. Kettlebells, that's where they're at. Second round done. Let's get ready for that fourth round. Let's get ready for that third round. Again, if at any point you gotta take a longer rest time, go ahead and do that. I'm going at my pace, okay? Just don't feel discouraged that I'm moving a lot faster, okay? You can always look at the setup of the program today and then adjust it to your level of fitness. Just don't make it too easy, okay? There's gotta be effort if you wanna see results. Third round.
stop sleeping on this training, okay? I'm here showing you the results, showing you the work I put in. It works, it's sustainable, okay? And it'll make you strong, okay? You'll build strength, you'll build endurance, you'll build muscle. Get on it. Four simple exercises put together in a complex. I'm breaking a sweat. Uh, I'm where to, I'm almost, I'm where to, it's hard for me to hold uh, somewhat of a conversation, okay? So that's where you wanna be when you're training. That's where you know that you're on the right level. Fourth round, let's go. Throw your floors out. I know everybody doesn't have uh, rubber mats. Okay, so put them, put those kettlebells nice, nice and easy. Fourth round, fifth round for the finale. Even myself, I gotta remind myself to be conscious of how I breathe. Sometimes I mouth breathe and I can tell that, man, I'm not recovering as fast. So just now I caught myself. So again, everything I apply to myself, I show to you, you're gonna get results out of it as long as you put in the work. If you avoid the work, forget about it. Going the four strength pack. Final round. It's been strong. And that's how we do it here in the Four Chunk Channel. If you stood this far, I appreciate the support. Keep pushing hard. Don't give up on yourself. Remove all doubts, all insecurities, all fear, all the fear you have. Okay, whatever you put in your mind, all right, that's what uh, you're gonna generate. So let's stay mentally strong. Let's keep physically pushing and that's the only way to get to that self. Getting physically uncomfortable so you can push your mind not to give up. All right, that's all I have to say for today. I appreciate your support. If you find any value in this content, you already know what to do. Keep at it. Let's keep grinding. Four strength, out.